Hello everyone! Welcome back to this game! When we last left off, I saw the puzzle! Yay! I gotta say, this game definitely has some good puzzles in it. Okay, we're on the top floor. Let's see if we can make our way to Kathy's dad. And then, of course, you're gonna leave at this point. We'll not be able to go much further. I will remain here. In this room. Please wake me if you require assistance. Catch up to me when you can. Of course. Wh why can't you come with us? Right, right. The whole you only get in the way thing. This looks like a for real Z's possibly a room we're going to be chased in. It's too bad that they weren't able to finish turning Kathy into a doll. Maybe that teddy bear would leave us alone. Supposedly, it'll only chase creatures that are alive. Where is Fee, I wonder? Or Fi? Still not entirely sure. Oh, we got the code for the elevator on this floor. We'll need that. It's locked. Turn around and get chased, right? Maybe? Is there a path that I missed? Maybe there's a path that I missed. There's a path that I missed. Well, as long as I'm passing the save point and keeping the code. Here we go. Mm -mm. And I'm out of the shiny things for... The, the pills. Sight pills. I'm kind of missing them. Kind of a bummer, I could use some. Well, I managed. There were some more shiny things that were there, probably just to distract me, kind of think of it. I should keep moving. Kind of think of it, there was that hallway back on the, th on the second floor? And I passed up a save point along the way. Maybe the save point was a distraction, but maybe it actually is something. Stockholm's is personal laboratory. Huh. Well, let me look at these other rooms. Stockholm's office? You know, maybe we will actually finish the game today. I need to check Father's office. Okay. To the laboratory. Okay, fine. The office. But he's not in there. Father, are you there? Elaine. That would be Kathy's mom. Elaine, ever since you've gone, things have gotten worse at home. Catherine locked herself in her room and wouldn't utter a word to me. Alcohol kept me going, but it wasn't enough. Nothing is the same without you. There is this very faint heartbeat sound in the background. As well as a piano music. A code inside the door. I'll check out this later. I need to find Father. Sure, don't grab the thing that we might need in an emergency. Elaine Stockholms. She will always be there watching over her family. Well, that would... That would explain why these statues remind Catherine of her mom.
Maybe we will finish this game today. Did I already say that? No. It can't be. Not you too, father. I don't even see him. Why? Why did you have to die? I have nothing left. There you are, Miss Catherine. My apologies for taking so long. I am truly sorry. He's gone. He's gone forever. I'm all alone. This is not true. I am here for you. I will always be here for you. <laughs> Young Miss, knowing your father, he would not want you to perish in a place like this. So I ask that you bear with it just for a bit longer. What's the point anymore? Maybe I'm better off dead. No, I will not let that happen. You still have a bright future ahead of you, and I will do all that I can to help you reach that future. But I need your help in this, so please, please get up and let us make one last push to escape this factory. Maybe I can try for a bit longer, for father's sake. Thank you for comforting me. That's a bummer. Young Miss. Let us head outside, young Miss. I still can't see him. Gosh, I wish I had another one of those bright pills. Okay. Young Miss, please take a look at the code in this drawer. If only you could be here with me. The paper might be useful. We should take it with us. Laboratory code. Well, that's where we're going next. Seems this door requires a password to open. The puzzle is that the code is covered up while we're typing it. Oh gosh, what do you think we'll be finding in there? It's his personal laboratory. You think it's going to be her mom? Perhaps you should try rearranging the letters. Hmm. I am so glad that I've been writing these names down. There is no way I would be able to unjumble these letters on my own. It is unlocked. Shall we continue forward? Okay. And by forward, I mean back to the C point so that I don't have to do that part again. Well, there's another C point in here, for what that's worth. There is a CD over on that counter. 
Perhaps it can give us more information about your father. Alright, now we're talking. Huh? The computer is still operational. Let's view the content of the CD. Of course. It's... It's father talking. January 26th, year one. This is the first day of the project. There will be no going back now. June 2nd, year two? Boy, that's a time skip. Our first volunteer? Oh, so there were volunteers. Or do you mean to put volunteers in air quotes? A man with leukemia suffered from brain damage and died shortly after the experiment. It was regrettable, but necessary. March 25th, year 3. We are short on test subjects. So I pleaded to my colleague for assistance. Using her influences, the colleague managed to secure some death row and life sentence convicts for experimentation. November 18th, year 4. Nothing is working. The subjects keep dying. I already spent most of my fortune. Am I just chasing a miracle? What should I do, Elaine? That is the end of the video. Information about the Living Doll Project must only be shared with a selected few. Widespread knowledge of the project could hinder it. The trusted few will be held accountable for the direction and outcome of the project. Well, they certainly screwed the pooch on this one. Father is full of secrets. Top Y, discovering of the subject's special power. X, the first successful experiment. Bottom Y, nearing bankruptcy. X, the living doll project begins. Gonna have to keep that information in mind. There are several video clips on this computer. Do you want to view them, young miss? It'll probably increase her heart rate, but sure. Hmm. This isn't father's voice. December 30th, year 4. Success at last! We were on the verge of abandoning the project, too, but thankfully the new volunteer arrived. Our efforts are finally paying off. Who is the volunteer? Because Catherine was in the train wreck on that one day at the end of the year. May 5th, year 5, with the first project a success, we went further and experimented on more test subjects. I believe we are just missing a few key components to perfect our creations. Okay, so that wasn't Catherine. December 24th, year 5, the higher-up asked us to experiment on a new test subject immediately. The subject has only been at the factory for less than a day. February 28th, year 6, the new subject exceeded all our expectations. She even developed a strange power to control dolls. Father's safe. 
Enter a password? Not yet. So this is the puzzle we're dealing with. So how much information is given to us as we try to put this in? Yep, ex that's that. Okay, this one I actually do have to write down. So top drawer is month discovery of special power. Day, first successful experiment. Bottom drawer. Muff, nearing bankruptcy. I do remember seeing that mentioned at some point. And the day, living doll project begins. So, let's go ahead and figure this out now. So, the day is... January 26th. And when was he nearing bankruptcy? November. Which is the 11th month. So first successful experiment is day, day 30, and special power, is February, which is the second month. So let's start with the top door, month 2. Oh wait, month two and day thirty. The gold key! The last key we need to get out of this place. Okay, but what about the other one? I have all the keys to escape. I should be happy, yet I feel so empty. Everything will be okay. We will make it through this. Yeah, yeah, new objective. But what about the other drawer? Let me save on a separate file just in case something stupid happens. Father, save. Let's go for the bottom drawer. So day 26 and month 11. Some pills. Stability. And that's it. So we have all the keys. And our next task is to make our escape. Alright, let's go. I assume that's our next task. I have all the necessary keys. I should make my way back to the factory entrance. Okie doke. Where's the elevator? The doll slips and falls down, dropping a brooch in her pocket. Fascinates with it, Catherine picks up the item. Oh, before we move on, by the way, in case anybody watching is interested and want to play the game yourself without possibly being spoiled by whatever is about to happen, here is a link to where you can find the game. And those of you watching this at YouTube, I'm also going to be providing a link in the description. With that said, what about this brooch? Agnes is the maid. Young Miss, what is this? 
Agnes, Mommy and I got it for you. It's for all the hard works you did last year. Little Kathy picked it out for you. I... I am touched. So is Agnes actually... the doll? Is she the one that can't remember? From the bottom of my heart, thank you, madam. Thank you, young miss. I am very grateful to be here. Here is your brooch. Thank you. Please excuse me for my clumsiness. It's okay. What troubles you? Is something the matter? Agnes. You don't have to withhold information from me anymore, Agnes. I see. So you know. Why did you hide your identity from me? With your mental state at that time, it was not a wise choice to reveal everything. I felt that it would overwhelm you and worsen your heart condition. I am sorry. <laughs> That's okay. I'm happy to know that you've been with me all along, Agnes. Anyway, were you the only maid my father dragged into this? I don't think of it, there were no cards mentioning maids. No, Mr. Stockholms also brought in Annabelle and Bella. Oh, where are they? Gone. I'm sorry. If there is anything I can. No point in talking about it now. Let us keep moving. Escaping this factory should be our main priority. Y you're right. Ugh, I feel like we are so close to the end right now. But I don't know that for certain. A part of me wants us to go over time here. Just in case I'm right at the end. But past experience has shown me that going over time because I'm close to the end might result in me not actually being near the end. So even though we might be one episode away from reaching the end, I think I'm going to have to call this stream right here. And next time, quite possibly, we'll be finishing this game. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next one.